Stop, Catwoman! She's running! I see the other guy. She went up in the air! Huh? Sky looks so much better when it's not full of helicopters that are all trying to kill us. Here we go. That's all of it. Now what's a girl to do? I could quit this crazy town, but where's the fun in that? Okay, so all I have left to do now is, well, for this playthrough, is get the rest of the collectibles and clear out the rest of the side missions. I did give her all the her upgrades, right? Yeah. Okay. We did it. We actually did it. There's still work to do here in Arkham City. Let me check something real quick. score okay so I'm actually I'm pretty close to being 400,000 TA score now uh, code monkeys I have I'm 80 TA score away from 400,000 okay so let's see what I want to do um Side missions. Shot in the dark. I don't exactly know how to continue those. Have twelve mis Mister uh, Murderous. Oh, have 12 murderous dates with the counterman. Stop all assaults in Arkham City. And then Deadshot and nail him. Okay, so at certain points in Arkham City, you will hear a shot and receive a message telling you to search the area for dead shots missions.
Mm. Uh, okay, so I have to basically stumble upon these. And uh, the act of violence. So uh, what I think I'm going to do, since I have all the collectibles, I'm going to start going through and getting all the collectibles one by one and opening up... Um, well, yeah, I'm just going to start going through and getting collectibles. And if I stumble upon some of the side missions, I'll definitely go for them. And do I want to go for Easter eggs, too? Easter eggs are fun. Alright, so... Easter egg number four. Secret coded messages. After reading the game, using the cryptographic sequencer will reveal three separate messages on various signals and at an end of a... An end, and at the end, a chime. These numbers can be deciphered. So the first broadcast is... 700... X... By 500. Okay, so the message reads 923, 912, 12, 18, 5, 20, 21, 18, 14, 2, 1, 20, 13, 1, 14. And you can decode it using the Caesarian cipher, which uh, is essentially just 1 through 26, um, A through Z. So A would be 1. B2, C3, and you can decipher that message to be... The message will read, I will return Batman. Alright, let's... So, 5 by 900. That's a long sequence. Anyways, so the numbers read 5, 15, 9, 7, 21, 18, 18, 14. I'm not going to even read the numbers, but if you were to decipher those numbers using the Caesarian shift method, uh, where the alphabet is um, going in reverse, so Z to A, 1 through 26. Um, if you decode that, you get the message, you will pay for what you have done to me. So, I will return Batman, you will have, you will pay for what you have done to me. Alright, so then there's a third message you can decode. Which is 200 by 500. Okay, so this is actually a pretty difficult. This 
code is actually pretty, that signal is actually pretty difficult to decode. Um, but if you decode it using the Vigineer cipher, using the, with the keyword Scarecrow, the message will read, Fear will tear Gotham to shreds. So, that's possibly a hint for, thing, or for things to come. Okay. I'm gonna for another Easter egg while I'm at it. Alright, so after so after the end of the game. Alright, so I'm looking for the I gotta look for the Arkham City sign. Which is located somewhere near that Wonder City Tower. Nip. Yeah, there it is. That is pretty easy to find. Okay, so... Trying to figure out. He landed on top of the Arkham City sign. That I know. Can you get up to the Arkham City sign? Maybe I have to be inside there. Going Easter egg hunting. Rule two. All prisoners must surrender themselves for full psychiatric examination when requested. Failure to surrender will be met with extreme force, followed by a level nine and ten psychiatric profiling. Rule three. Tiger officers. I don't know if I can even get over there. Do me a favor. Can you figure out how to get to where, uh, the Easter egg with Brawl's all cool? Where he dies at the end of the game. Or supposedly dies, because, you know, how the Batman universe is. Oh, there we go. We got something I can interrogate. Alright, just gonna line launcher out here. And eh, maybe I don't need to.
trying to do a silent game now. Solid food. Please, I'll tell you what I know. Good. That should prove useful. Have that interrogation. Hotel. Which hotel in particular? Yeah, I know, but like, a little bit more of an idea than that. There it is. Or not. Sometimes the auto targeting doesn't work very well. Oh. oh. Okay. So not not even in this way at all. So I gotta I gotta head back out then. That's all right. Made a little detour. Got some collectibles. I'm gonna get some more. I mean, do you have to be in the open part of the city? You're supposed to take the floor grate to get there? Probably not. Let's see. No. Um. Let's see. Uh, trying to figure out how to get over there. kind of opening or hole in the ceiling possibly I don't know sometimes the navigation and this is a bit annoying wait I think I maybe over here no I think I found it. I'm just going over into this section right here now that I get the interrogation and all the collectibles. I should be able to get everything I need. And I'm going to do just that. Okay, so there's a collectible directly below me. Or above. Still there, Sebastian?
fortification? Yeah. I'll have to check that out here in a bit. After I get all the other collectibles. So I hate when he just like just goes straight down. Oh fuck. Oh, it's on the ceiling. So it's been a while since I talked to you, uh, Sebastian. How you been, man? You plan on streaming anytime in the near future? I think I or I recall you mentioning it. Just curious. I remember this. And I couldn't for the life of me figure out what I'm supposed to do. Whoa, what? What happened? My game just crashed. Yeah, I saw it. Whoa. The power just cut out. The TV stayed on, though. No, the game just crashed randomly. <clears throat> Fucking game. Anyways, no, I was wondering uh, if you were planning on streaming in time in the future, in the near future, and um, I was wondering how you how you have been lately. I haven't talked to you in a while. That was bullshit. Yes. Look, thank God for auto saves. 60% of my total statistics. Oh, okay. I'm cur I'm curious what kind of equipment you you decided to with. That sucked. I can't believe that. It's like all that effort and the game just crashes. Like the navigation is just kind of annoying, so I gotta like. Figure it out. <clears throat> Let's see if I saw the Riddler trophy at least. No. Oh, I didn't lose a lot of progress. Still annoying though. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm interested, man, to see see what you uh, end up doing with your stream. I mean, if you want any advice. Um, I can I can give you some advice on streaming and uh, more particularly the um, the programs I use and how I optimize to be able to run uh, and try to minimize any like lag or any like uh, any stuttering or anything. So, so I'm on a I'm on like a mid I don't know, I'm on like I'm on like a I'm on a laptop and it's not really the greatest for streaming. But I make do. <laughs> I 
<laughs> eh. If it works, it works. Let's see. Am I supposed to just climb the wall like that? Because that'd be really weird if I supposed to. Wait a second. I think I know what I'm supposed to do. I think I'm supposed to wire walk. I was trying to <laughs> find some kind of clever way to get up there. Um, what do I do here? Oh, no problem, man. I'm not really doing anything. I'm not really doing much uh, else in this. Uh, probably tonight. I'm just going through and getting some collectibles and checking out some Easter eggs. Uh, I got a ton of collectibles to still get. And I got uh, some side missions to still finish, but other than that, this playthrough is basically done. At least the major points. Hey, what's up, Top Blue Nose 72? Alright, how the fuck. <laughs> what do I do? I, I don't get it. What are you? What am I supposed to do here? I don't get it. Can I jump off of this? <coughs> um. I, well, after I finished Batman: Arkham City. I was thinking about going through Batman Arkham Origins next, but Batman Arkham City is such a... It takes so much time. Uh, you gotta play through the game twice, and then you gotta do a ton of challenge... Mo or, uh, you have to do a ton of challenges. And... So, yeah. I was thinking about playing Assassin's Creed Brotherhood and Assassin's Creed Revelations next, but I was also thinking about playing Castlevania... Har uh, Symphony of the Night and Harmony Despair. Um. <clears throat> yeah, I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to do here. I thought I just had a <clears throat> line walk or something. Oh, you completed Arkham Knight last yesterday. Nice, man. <clears throat> did you play through... Did you complete everything in the game? Yeah. You can just give me the solution. <laughs> this, is a, this is annoying. Like, I don't understand, like, a... <laughs> Fuck you guys. <laughs> uh... Let's see. Glide or grapnel boost. I'm not exact. I'm not exa exactly sure. <clears throat> I 
Oh yeah, that's that's right. I can actually grapple and just use the back claw. I can't I can't use the back claw when I'm on sitting on the line launcher. Yeah. Oh. I have an idea. <clears throat> But it was an idea nonetheless. It's still possible what I'm trying to do. So why does he like dive headfirst into it? <clears throat> I know he's trying to land on it. Okay. So I feel like I have to I'm trying to think where I'm position myself. Detective mode. This is a weird. Just punch, punch it. <laughs> Maybe... I uh, got an idea. Oh. <clears throat> okay, I think I have an idea. Um... If I'm going to glide out, then I'm going to try to grab no boost over here. There we go. No, oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> I didn't want to do that. I thought I had my. Uh, I thought I had my back clock selected. There we go. So yeah, it was the grapple boost. I think you just have to glide from a higher point. So then you can grapple here. I mean, at least that worked out. <clears throat> 